Well, hello, hello there. The Coliseum welcomes you, my friends. We are back with our big 400 subscriber extravaganza. Ergo, let's play some magic. So, what do we got in the Coliseum today? We got a nice little contender. Very familiar, yet somewhat different. I'm just calling it big Celestia-ish. And honestly, we have a sideboard build, but I think we should start off with some best of one games, if only because I love temporary lockdown in the best of one meta. Granted, we'll probably never run into anything where it's good, but with all the mono reds and crapping around, this is a fun card to play. But let's go over it real quick. So there's nothing too crazy or new here. We got Ambitious Farm Hand fetching early lands alongside ter uh, Topiary Stomper, the aforementioned temporary lockdown. Archangel of Wrath at a full set, a depopulate in addition to four Sunfalls. So we're really playing that sweeper card. Uh, we got um, Invasion of Zendikar to ramp, and then of course at the top end, a set of Leyland Binding, a trio of Herd Migration, and a full set of uh, Miss Atraxa the Grand Unifier. Nothing too crazy or different. It just seems like we're really trimming out, we're really trying to nail it down to two colors with a splash. Hence, big Celestia ish. Now, as far as the sideboard goes, we do get a little more colorful there. Keep all of our white stuff up here. We got an Elspeth Smite, a Destroy Evil, and Annex Sentry. In addition to Boonbringer Valkyrie, which I'm excited to try out. It's, a bit, it's, it's another form of a Baneslayer Angel, but you never know. You might want to throw the backup counter somewhere else and pass on that Flying for Strike and Life Link to, say, a Topiary Stomper or... Yeah, probably not a Traxa. <laughs> uh, below that, we got... Uh, Two Duress, two Lithomantic Barrage, two Disdainful Strike, uh, Stroke, and two Knockout Blow. So we're ready for aggro, it seems. That does seem one of the weaknesses of this deck is you know, just getting run over before you stabilize. So looks like we had a lot of options there. My friends, if this is your first time at the Coliseum, smash that like button, hit subscribe, drop a comment or a list if you'd like input. Otherwise, uh, yeah, where are we at? Oh, less than two minutes. It's a beautiful thing. Let's get to the games. Mm, oh, yuck. Yuck, we got tier two farmhand into absolutely nothing. The ley line binding is gonna cost four because we only have two things. Let's go ahead and mulligan this one. Boop. This is not much better, but at least it has stuff to do. So we're gonna go ahead and track this to the bottom. Let's hope we can hit some stuff. Otherwise, we will be dead very quickly, my friends. If we do not hit our other land. Ooh, spyglass siren. Yeah, I swear I just did did we just Okay, just making sure. Hmm. We might just end up dead here before anything happens, but, you know, what else is new? Oh, no, not Deep Cavern Bat. No! Alright. Oh! Well, there goes... He's gonna probably grab Topiary Stomper. And then all we can really do is hold out for our fourth land for Invasion of Zendikar. Ideally an untapped land, but you never know. Bat! No! Interesting. Hmm. Was I holding up a counter spell here? Why wouldn't you play the bat? Oh, let's try topiary, topiary stomper. See if it resolves. We're gonna go get probably. Eh, it doesn't really. Oh yay! Double white, red, green. Oh, sneaky! Well, I mean, it gives me a 4-4 out of the deal. That's pretty nice. Yep. <laughs> He's probably going to go for the Invasion of Zendikar here, which is fine. Maybe he'll attack with the Tidebinder, but that'll just make our Topiary Stomper not do anything anymore. But it will get rid of the Tidebinder, so, eh. How many lands are we playing in this pile? 27? Yeah, we should top deck a land eventually. Oh, he's got the removals. All the removals. Yep, yep. How about that? Hmm. That's awkward. Yeah. Let's go and get another stomper out there. I was thinking, debating between the stomper and the chump blocker, but uh, let's see. We don't want to go on other lanes. We didn't have the ability to double spell, so we might as well use our mana as efficiently as possible. Yep, how about that? We might just be dead before anything happens here. Hmm. Let's see, he's got three in the air. A single removal spell kills anything, so I'm just gonna go Ambitious Farmhand, go get a Plains, play the Plains, pass the turn. Hope it's good enough. If it's not, oh wells. Yes, please. Get ready for the concession! Let's 
that'll do it. Quick start, quick finish. All right, what we got? Uh, this is at least better. It's not the most exciting. We could just get run over. But what else is new, right? About to go get a planes with that first hard migration, depending on what opponent. No! <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> we have the slowest possible head. At the time we need it. Uh, at the time we need speed. Well, the good news is we got six life in our hand, and then hopefully we get to attract, so that's our goal here. Bloodthirsty adversary, yep. So, I'm gonna be able to undo that attack. Bonk. Oh boy. Let's keep it up. You gotta be wondering, where are all these sweepers we boasted? Isn't this the entire reason we're doing this? Oh jeez, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh lord. Lord, hear me. Hear me, give me any of my sweepers, any of them. Please, Lord. Where's that depopulate? Lord, hear me, Lord. Oh, jeez. All right, well, here we go, people. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, we're probably dead here before anything even happens. Uh, you know, maybe two is enough to show us this is a best of three deck. <laughs> the tracks that can't even save us. Mm, all he needs is any of his, uh, any of his things. Yeah, that'll do it. Okay, well, we're off to a swimming start. Let's hop over to the best of three. <laughs> the irony that I thought this would be better for best of one is not lost upon me. Oh, on the draw. Sasuunu. Oh, look. Look who it is, everyone. Yeah, it's fine. At least we have the turn to... Oh, <laughs> We finally get it. And it doesn't matter because it's a mirror match. Or at least presumably a mirror match. I'm guessing it's a mirror match. If that's the case, yeah, we'll be bringing in, getting rid of our temporary lockdowns, bringing in like disdainful stroke and all that stuff. Probably bringing in duress. Yep, beautiful. And he's got the ley line at the ready. So let's go and go forest and pass turn. All right, so we got a couple useless cards here. Yep. Let's go get a planes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. Hmm. Yeah, I guess this is our play. Go get another planes. And then we got Invasion of Zendikar into a Traxa, which is something. Let's see what he's got. Worst case scenario would be Invasion of Zendikar into Untapped White Source into. Oh. Uh, okay. I'm oddly okay with this. Oh, he does have it. Yeah. Let's say worst case scenario would be. Yeah, that is the worst case scenario, because now he gets to flip his invasion and potentially untap it into craziness, whereas we're going to sit here twiddling our thumbs. And that's the play versus the draw, baby. Durr, durr. Dang. Brutal. Brutal. Yep, how about that? Oh boy, all the attractions in the world aren't going to be able to save us here. Alright, so what do we need? Island of Swamp. Yep. That would be nice to hit something here. Oh, up the beanstalk. Nice. Yep, down to 15. Bonk, bonk. Oh. Hmm. Now well, we know he's got at least a ley line binding. Do we want to shoot something down? We could double kick this Archangel and then follow up with the Atraxa. Or we could just take the card advantage. This is a very good chance that he's got. Well, that's just it. Let's go Atraxa here. Let's draw a bunch of cards. If he has the removal for it, we have the removal for the removal. Alright, I'll take a Topier Stomper, we'll take uh, an Inkanjo, we'll take, ooh, no, actually, we'll take a Boseju, and then I suppose a Sunfall. 
Three cards will discard temporary lockdown, even though it does have a purpose right now. Hmm. If he kills the Atraxa, we are ready. Nope. Either he doesn't have it, or he didn't opt to use it. Let's discard temporary lockdown. He's like, my own Atraxa! Ha 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 ha! That would be sweet. It's Atraxa, dude. You know what Atraxa does. Don't have enough mana to... Oh, no! Yep. Yeah. How about that? All right, so now I'm thinking the plan is Archangel of Wrath, flip the invasion of Zendikar, play the land. Yeah. Hmm, interesting. Mm, we don't have enough white mana to do everything. It's okay. Now we do. So if this dude do this dude like this, make some go vigilance. I'm gonna play Dreadmere's Garden. Let's go to combat. Boop. Mmm, it's all for me. Yep, he's fishing for something big. I'll make him take care of this board before I uh, go for another attraction. So. Hmm, that'll do it. All the sun falls. Sure. Yep. I could take three here potentially. Could have floated a white for the ley line, but mm, we got a ley line. Up the beanstalk, maybe. I don't know. I'm gonna save the ley line for a potential bigger, scarier threat. Okay, well, he's not turning any of his bots into dudes, so looks like we're okay for a Traxa for a turn. Probably a Traxa leaving a white open. Go from there. See what we draw. He's got three cards in his hand, but it could be undone very quickly. Or we can continue with developing the board. Ooh, that's spicy. Takes care of all this stuff and up the beanstalk, and then we still got what? One, two, three, four. Mm, we can go topiary stomper into temporary lockdown. I don't hate it. Let's get rid of all that garbage. Let's go topiary stomper. Let's grab a, I don't know, but a mountain. Yeah, it's past turn. Okay. Let's see what he hits. Mm-hmm. Yep, mm-hmm. Yep, mm-hmm. Yep, yep, yep. So he's got a backup of track, so... It's okay. Good gravy. This is gonna be such a slog. Oh, well, what are you going to do, right? He got two cards out of that deal. All right, so we definitely... Hmm. Let's just say we definitely don't want to... Well, I won't say that. He's got another Traxa in the waiting. Don't want to Sunfall until he commits to his herd migration and his other Traxa. We'll just probably play our Traxa and pass. Wait. Two, three, four, five. He's only got five mana open. Is he thinking of doing an angel here? Oh, up the beanstalk. Sure. I feel like that probably should have been played first. Uh, do I want to ley line the attracts at end of turn? I do not believe so. Not yet, anyways. There we go. Right, leave an open double white. We'll do it. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay, excellent ley line, sunfall. I suppose. Cavern of Souls. Yeah, we don't really need much in the way of fixing. 
But the other one, you know, no, we'll just do this. We'll just do this and name Angel. And do I want to discard or do I want to ley line binding this Atraxa? Let's ley line binding the Atraxa. Attack with our Topiary Stomper. And that's all for us. Yep. He's got another tracks, uh, herd migration, three other sunfall. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sure. Fall of the sun. This is a mirror match, except he has up the beanstalk instead of uh, ambitious farmhand. Ugh. I guess technically it's all a mirror match. Anything else kind, sir? Perhaps. Perhaps. Oof. Okay. <sighs> do 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 do. How are we doing on deck sizes? Thirty three to twenty nine. Okay. Just checking. Great, what a snooze fest. I might not have enough time for another match after this one. This is still game one. Oh lord. Hey look, it's a track, so what are the odds? Yeah. Mm, bonk. Let's see what he hits. Another migration, Nisa. Oh, that's brutal. No, we're not gonna scoop, but that is brutal. Worst part is Nisa can uh, well, pretty much take us down uh, whenever. Debating between hitting the Nisa and hitting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We don't have enough to do 7. Well, I guess I could play the Bosage as an untapped land, then we'd have enough to do everything. Sunfall and a track, so mm. I'm just debating. Yeah. Ah, jeez. All right, let's do the time. Let's do the time warp again. All right, what do we got? Take a track, so I'm taking on tap planes, and that's it. That's all we want. On tap planes. Um. Hmm. Got four cards. Do I want to do anything else or do I just want to discard? <sighs> the problem with this is he's got Nissa to play and destroy my ley line binding. He's getting back the attracts us. That's why I don't want to. I'll just pass. I'll just discard a Sparrow's headquarters. I'd rather cycle it, but at this point, let's just play it by ear. <sighs> oh boy. Yep, how about that? You gotta try harder than that, homie. I could have waited, drawn the cards, but that would have been smart. Yep. Yep. Oh, now I don't have a choice. Now I gotta wait. <laughs> we got two ley lines. One of them could get both sage, dude. Okay. Means I go for the overrun, I'm guessing. Buy me some. Hmm. 
This will get the Bosejo out of his hand. Hmm, yeah, there's a lesson in here. Depends on what he uses to tap. Ah, dang it, that means he probably does have another one. Hmm, that one. I'll go with that one right there. Anywho. Yeah, the lesson in here was you sh I should have let him hit the, uh... Gobble, gobble. I should have let him hit the... Hmm, my... Attracts a first, then got it back so I'd have the card advantage from it, but no oh well. It's got herd migration. Ah, forget it. <laughs> Just keep it going. <laughs> Alright, Stomper, Leyline, uh, Depopulate. Nope. Herd migration, Invasion. Beep. And discard down to seven. Last planes, play set planes. Ah, uh, past turn. All right, so what do we got here? What's our avenue to victory? Jeez, oh, more sunfalls. Yep, sure, dude. Oops, not what I meant to do. There we go. Yawn. What was he doing on the cards? <laughs> oh, we're aiming for the uh, decking angle, apparently. Good gravy, this is still the first friggin' game. Archangel of Wrath. Yep, I see where this is going. Yep, yep, yep. I'm gonna let this happen, and then I'll Archangel of Wrath the Zendikar token in order to get that life back. At least try to. Hmm. Hmm. He did not activate his 3-3. Three, three. A tell. Might be a tell. Ow. Anything else, kind sir? Anything at all? He's still got two herd migrations he's sitting on. We're just all trying to nickel and dime each other. Okay. Anything else? Anything at all? Topiary Stomper, sure. At this point, it might just be better to Sunfall. No, we'll just, uh, I don't know. I'll just answer in kind. We want to do kill the Archangel. No, we want to kill the... Let's see here. That looks good. That's a lot of white to use. Oh, well. Hmm. Hit the Mana Source of the Reacher. Well, we're going to play, what, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We're going to play Double Stomp here after this, so... All right, set the mana source. Gravy, this is still the first game. <laughs> mm -hmm. Stomper, I don't think we have any. Uh... Nope. Nope. All right, well, that's all for us, sir. How many sun balls we got left? One, two, three, four. No more. I have not cast a single one yet. Good gravy. This is why I tend to stick to aggro. And we're not just counting cards left in the library. 17 to 22. All four of our tracks are gone. Boo. We can get that other one back at any point with this ley line. There's herd migration. Yeah. Boo. Mm, looks like a good time for a sun poly. Eh? Mm -hmm. 
Maybe, actually. Maybe not. Hmm. Well, let's attack with everything and see what happens. Oh, probably everything but the Archangel over us. Let's attack with the Topiaries. Well, I'm attack with the Angel. Get one of these Sun Poles out of our hand. Yep. We'll each gain three life. Bzz. And then a sunfall of our very own. Beep boop 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 boop. And let's see, 21 cards left. I'm gonna hold on to the uh, Spar's headquarters. We know the invasion of Zendikar isn't gonna do anything, so we'll just pass. Hmm. Can we see what's on? Are we back to the point where we can now? Yep. Yep. He knows we have another sunfall, so. Probably gonna sunfall and then try to attack for 10. Probably into his 3 3, but nah, that's the way it goes. Stomper. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh my goodness, why did I think playing <laughs> playing ramp would be a good time? Uh, I don't know. Nice. Boop. My fault. My turn to sunfall a million times. Let's try to get him for 10. He just black with his 3 3. I'm not going to stop that. He's all out of sunfalls, but he could still have depopulate or. Um, oh, depopulate or any other sweep or so. Farewell could be a thing, too. I don't know if they still play those or not. Let's play a Stomper. Get another beater out there. All done. Oh, that's right. We can't see it because we keep shuffling it around. Derp. Derp a derp. <clears throat> okay. Show me what you got. I want to see what you got. Still sitting on our herd migration. Hoping he'll do something. He's got six cards in his hand. Archangel of Wrath. Sure. Bye, Topiary Stomper. Yep. Yep. Pew 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 pew. Yep. Pew 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 pew. He did. He got him. Another herd migration. Good gravy. <sighs> How many is that? Is that all of them? One, two, three, four. That's all of them, so I'm gonna deal with this one more friggin' time. My turn. Interesting. Let's get in for 16 and see what happens. I'll just play my own herd migration since he's out of sweepers. We'll just go from there. I was like, dude, you gotta block. Don't don't not block. Nice, right, so we'll kill the angel. I could ley line up binding the angel, but I'm just gonna hold on to the last ley line until something crazy happens. Hmm, interesting. Heard migration of my very own in turn. We're trying, folks. We're trying. <laughs> oh, if only my Sunfall token had haste. Depopulate. Okie dokie, artichoke. Oh, it can. Slaw continues on. Yep. Yep. Cards left, 11, but no more lands. He pulls out a fifth herd migration. Like, what? Get out of here. Another Archangel of Wrath. Yep. Down to nine. Oh, boy. 
Oh boy. Have we been out? Somehow out threaded? Apparently, that's fine. Pew, pew. All right, well, we still got stuff. I don't know if I'd count that as it, so I'll go. Cycle. Draw something that doesn't suck, preferably. Mm, not what I had in mind. Cycle. Draw something that doesn't suck, preferably. Nope, not what I had in mind. Good gravy. There's not any of our stuff. Does that do anything? And it does not. It does not in the slightest. Oh. It's uh, past turn. It's only one thing left to be done here. I don't know if it'll work, but it may. Oh boy. Beautiful. All right, well, we are looking for a sunfall off the top or something, because now we're out of stuff to do. I'm down to two. Good gravy, what a game. If he has another Archangel of Wrath, it's just over, baby. He very well may. Mm-hmm. Okay. It doesn't really matter. I don't think he has any basics left. Good to know, though. What do we have left? Well, that'll do. No responses, so, uh... Yes, I'll pass. Yeah, nothing really to do here. What do we have left? Two Archangel Wrath, two Herd Migration to finish this game out. Oh, that'll do it. Jeez, what a slog. Good gravy. Okay, well, let's get rid of Temporary Lockdown. I'm gonna drop one Depopulate. Let me duress. Disdainful Stroke. I want destroy evil. What else do I not want here? There's some fun. Oh, vicious farm here can go. Okay. All right. Oh man, I hope this one's quicker. <laughs> Otherwise, this is just gonna be like what? I'm just gonna be done. Come on, opponent, it ain't that difficult. <laughs> Just a mirror match. Hmm. Come on, what we got? Come on, homie, what you got? Let's get to it. Oh, man, what a slog. Remind me not to play ramp. <laughs> <laughs> as powerful as it is. Actually, there's one ramp list I've got uh, queued up for best of one that's like just pure discovery combo. That one looks pretty fun, but everything else is, oh man. I imagine best of three is probably, well, you know, honestly, I expected more Esper than ramp in best of three, but, well, we all know how much the algorithm loves to make us play mirror matches. Oh well. Oh boy. Hmm. Okay, I'll be on the play. I will keep. It's not going to be a quick game. It's going to be a slow slog. Hmm. Maybe he brought in something really next level. Yep. That'd be cool to get blown away by something crazy. Turn three goblin, goblin rabble master. Ah, it's not in standard, but that used to be a fun thing to do. Just like, oh, I'm playing a ramp. Ah, what? Yep. Angel. We'll name cavern on angel, and then we will um, invasion. Yep, he's got the stomper, which means he might have the c -c combo. Which, if he does, oh well. We'll just go ahead and sunfall it all the way. Hmm. 
can just conceal that. Boop. All right. Let's see what we got. We're going to need a swamp. And I suppose we got red here, so just planes. And then we can Archangel over at the way, either his Stomper or his Invasion, or we can hit our Invasion. Or we can just Sunfall. Yeah, he's going to go this route. So probably just go Sunfall here. Well, probably worth waiting a turn, actually. Probably use Archangel Wrath to gun down his, uh, what's it called? Awakened Skyclave and go from there. Keep his mana somewhat constricted. He's got, yeah, he's got Domain up. Oh, that's a good one. Hmm, alternatively, I could just shoot down, or shoot ours. Hmm. Shoot ours, make a 4-4, attack for 4, see if he blocks it, go from there. Yeah. I don't know, our sideboard stuff kind of sucks, but oh well. Let's get in for 4. Yep. 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 Bzz. That's all for us. Okay. Yep. Hmm. That's fine. Another invasion. Hmm. Yeah, let's go play my other invasion and attack it down too. We'll see. Looks like we're all just playing the ramp game. And he does have a. Uh... I was gonna say he does have a. Uh, a Leyland Binding, it seems, because this priority is being held, but we'll see. Alright, what do we want here? I guess it doesn't try matter too much. We don't need red. We'll take off colors, I suppose. Well, I guess we'll take red. Why not? Pew! 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 Bonk. Let's cast it, and let's pass the turn. If he goes for the attack, we've got a Ganjo. Make it useful. And pass turn. It's probably just setting up for like a sunfall or something. Mm hmm. Attacking me. Hmm. Interesting. Time to play the game. It's five mana. Herd migration, sure. Hmm. Interesting. That's all for me. Not gonna sunfall just yet. Feels like bait. Yep. All coming at me. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Less than 12 minutes remaining. No! <laughs> Why is that my fault? <laughs> or is that his timer? Oh, mine's got 15. Oh, here comes Angel. No, another herd migration. What? Five 
Phyrexian. Hmm. Another herd migration. Good gravy. And a stomper. Sure. Use one of these destroy evils on the stomper. Alright, no priority held, so let's get in for 11. Nah, let's play a track, so. So, to track, so, Leyland Binding. I have no black open. Evasion, Duress. No, give me that Sunfall. Proving Grounds. Here we are. Up the beanstalk. Sure. I could have destroyed it with the trigger on the stack, but I'm really holding out here for something a little better. Okay, it may potentially lead to him drawing another card, but then again, you never know. We do have double A line up, triple A line in hand. So hopefully he can't get rid of the Atraxa. I say that as he like draws his own destroy evil or something cool. Ley line binding. Yep. Yeah, this time I'm gonna try to learn here. If he attacks, he's got something. If he doesn't attack, he's got nothing. If he doesn't attack, then I, th I think it's better just destroy eviling the leyline end of turn. If he does attack, we're gonna leyline binding, so we can fight over it. He doesn't, so we're gonna destroy evil end of turn. Otherwise, he would have the confidence to attack. I would assume Jetmir's garden gets cycled. Sure. No response. Right, let's find some answers here. All right. I got herd migration. We'll sage you. Take another track, so. Okay. All right, so what can we do here? Get in for seven, play our own. Yeah. We can just jump block. Nothing wrong with that. This will put us up to 24. And then we'll probably... we got to discard three cards. Probably discard the uh, invasion or play the invasion. Probably play the invasion, actually. It seems smarter. Yep. Three. One more. Okay. Hmm. Don't have enough mana to do everything we want to do, so we'll just do this. Oh, oh no, it left open. Uh... Oh, I discard two cards. What two cards are we gonna discard? Invasion of Zendikar and what? Let's get ready up the beanstalk. 
without this card invasion of Zendikar. At least stop him from cantripping off of everything. It does filter out a land, but again, then the invasion can go bye bye, and we'll just sit back and see what he's got. We got in. We've got an ley line open to sustain us. All right. See, you could be quick with these decks. Eh, not really. All right, I don't think I'm gonna change anything. Everything else seems fine. I think we both just didn't draw much. We got to rest, we got to sample stroke. We got stuff to do, time to do it. Let's do this. Good gravy, what a slog. <laughs> At least the coffee's good, right? Hmm. Echoes are incest from spirit. Strongly suited with the focus. Not in the blah, 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 blah. Abuelo. Hey, come back. I was reading that. Oh, whatever. Man. I was kind of hoping for something other than a mirror match. Not going to lie. Because probably not going to play another match after this, if only because of the sheer amount of time. So we'll see if we can grind out a win. Dang. If we cannot, then, well, that is the way it goes. Come on, people, where are we at here? Come on, come on, homie, where are we at? Hmm. What's this thing? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. No idea, what's this one? Nope, no idea what that is either. Hmm, no idea. Do de do do do. Come on, opponent. You couldn't. There's. I cannot imagine you saw anything you didn't anticipate seeing. You know. Uh oh. I do kind of miss the old um, rotation schedule, though. It'd be nice if we, certain things could be contained and then rotated. That was what's great about standard. <laughs> Excuse me. Hmm. Oh, da, 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 da. Good gravy. How much time was left? How long? How long until our opponent times out? Oh man. Oh man. Come on. What do you got? All right, here we go. Here we go. We're on. Give me some goods, baby. Give me the goods. All right, we got nine minutes to survive or win. Tick tock. Tick tock. Oh. Come on, homie. Come on, man. Well, actually, you know what? At this point, take your time. The time is. The clock is ticking. I don't know what's going on here. Hmm. I don't, honestly, I mean, we got, what, eight minutes? This is going to be interesting. Granted, how long was that last game? I don't know. I, I lost track. <laughs> was it eight minutes or less? I don't know. A slog fest like this, it could go either way. What if I should have kept in depopulate since he's so willing to just launch those herd migrations? No, we got four Sunfall. That should be enough. Temporary lockdown is not looking terrible, but I think I'd rather have the depopulate than temporary lockdown. Seven forty. I hate to stare at the clock, but come on, what what, what other choice do you give me here, man? Good gravy. Is this why people don't like best of three? I man, I don't blame you. But like I said, I'd normally be playing something a bit quicker or a bit more resourceful, you know. I feel like, in my personal opinion, I know like a lot of people like fast aggro, a lot of people like slow aggro. I'm a big mid-range guy. Like, I'm all about mid-range. Because it's usually, you can be quick and aggressive, but you have more efficient threats, and then you have interaction. Which is the one thing that I love. If there's no interaction, it's just like, I hope I can kill you before you kill me, then eh. That's kind of how I feel about Mono Red, which is why I'm so insanely triggered when I lose to it. And trust me, I lose to it all the time. Hence, triggered. It's a slippery slope, you know? <laughs> it starts as triggering, and then... Oh my god, it's the best possible outcome! He said, I can't win in seven minutes, so we are done here! And my god, we are, in fact, done here. Ho oh. ho. 
And we are back for the wrap-up. Oh my goodness, what a slog. Yes, that did everything we anticipated it would do. It was big, it was rampy, and it tried to do stuff. But I wasn't pretty wrong, I think, about the best of one scenario, because in best of one, we got straight up trampled. And that's the thing about uh, the ramp decks, the domain decks is... I mean, especially this one, since it's leaning away from earlier removal in different colors, even if it's something... Uh, even if it's just something simple... Since it's really trying to capitalize on sweepers, it can just get cut off guard and run over, like we saw. So I will I don't know if I take it to best of one, but best of three, I mean, it is a threat. We did win, and that is a plus, but man. If you had to, if you are hoping to get grind through the ladder, I would not recommend this one. No matter how good it is, if only because, dude, your time is valuable. <laughs> and I could be wrong. You could win a lot quicker than me. That could have just been the worst possible scenario, but... In my opinion, it's a fantastic deck, but if you're on the ladder trying to grind your way up, I, I would choose something, just something, I don't know. It's hard to say because, I mean, the deck has power. It has a lot of power with the tracks, uh, herd migration, all the good stuff going on. I mean, we know how good domain is, but jeez, you better have patience. All right, my friends, that's all from me. I will see everybody later.